application architecture. So by using these sets of services to follow the 10 design principles, the developer is not only meeting the core requirements for their modern app, but they're becoming more efficient in how they do their development. And this drives significant benefits for the business as a whole. You know, to illustrate these design principles and as a way to validate that we've got the right set, we decided to build our app that meets all the core requirements using the technology recommendations that we talked about. We also said it needs to be a beefy enough app from a functionality perspective so we can really battle test these principles. So we've built a patient care system that involves multiple entities, uh, a patient, a physician provider, a physician's assistants, etc. And it also involves a variety of scenarios that are involved in patient care, remote consultations, tracking outcomes, calendar event management, uh, using wearable devices to track health data, uh, detecting anomalies from those devices, and then using public data sets to garner information about the community health, etc. So we thought that'd be a great uh, validation of the design principles because we're building an extensive set of functionality and we're also trying to meet all these non-functional um, these, these non requirements that we've talked about. So as part of building this reference app, we leverage specific architecture patterns for various aspects of the app. And it turned out they actually represent a majority really of commonly used patterns in any modern app. So just like the 10 design principles we talked about today, you know, highlighting these patterns and then recommending the set of technologies to use for each of these patterns will actually simplify the decision making even further for app developers. So you'll be hearing a lot more about each of these patterns during the rest of the day today. Thank you for taking the time. I hope this was informative. Wish everyone the best and stay safe. Thank you. Thank you, Rajesh. Yeah, I really like your uh, pen design. Modern that. Uh, it's very structured, logical, and something I think each developer needs to uh, yeah, use or not thinking about all technology. Now, with all the questions raised, it looks like the audience is useful. Now, our next speaker is someone very, very special. In fact, many of you know him very well. His name is Anakaram NSD, a well-known analyst, architect, and advisor. He's an